A movie being shot in Tampa Bay is causing quite a commotion. It's called The Prophet, and filmmakers say the behind-the-scenes drama is being led by the Church of Scientology. 28 Tampa Bay's Kelly Swoop explains. Uh, the camera is going to be back over there. Since August, Peter Alexander has been directing a film in the Bay Area, but he's run into more problems on this shoot than he could have ever imagined. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. It's like a movie in and of itself. The movie is called The Prophet. It's a fiction film, and that's all we can tell you about it. But it has become the target of protest by Scientologists. Alexander was a Scientologist for 20 years, but left in 1997. They want to block the film, not even knowing what it's about, just because what their policy is is to destroy um, anyone who is opposed to uh, Scientology or who speaks out against it. The filmmakers say they've even had union protests. They suspect the protests were spearheaded by Scientologists. But union leaders claim unfair labor practices. The strike caused them to lose 20 members of the crew and shut down production for three days. And they will go to great lengths to stop the distribution of this film just because we're on the board of directors of the Lisa McPherson Trust. The Lisa McPherson Trust opened its doors in January as a result of Lisa McPherson dying at the Fort Harrison Hotel in 1997. Trust leaders say its mission is to expose abusive and deceptive practices of the Church of Scientology and to help people get out of the church. We get calls every single day from families that have been destroyed, from, from uh, parents who have lost their children. Stacy Brooks, a former Scientologist, is the president. She says they've been harassed, videotaped outside their offices, and even had a tough time finding office space even though there's plenty of vacancies in downtown Clearwater. She's not surprised by the problems that Alexander and producer Patricia Greenway have had making their movie. And we're on the board. We know we're going to be targets, but I, I, that's what I told our attorney. I did not want our employees to be brought into this, and that's the scary part, that all these people, that's not their, they don't even have much information on Scientology. Scientologists wouldn't appear on camera, but they don't deny they protested the movie. They've handed out literature and contacted crew members. But a spokesperson told me Scientologists say they've also been harassed. They believe the Lisa McPherson Trust is a hate group whose mission is to spread hateful propaganda. You know, this is the morning after. Right. Current productions will wrap up shooting the film this weekend. But for the director of the film, this saga isn't likely to end anytime soon because he doesn't plan on severing his ties with the Lisa McPherson Trust. In St. Petersburg, Kelly Swoop. 28 Tampa Bay News.